Again, everyone, 10 straight wins to open the season for the Cape Catfish. Could they make it 11 in a row? And how about this for their first meeting at home with the Thrillville Thrillbillies? A fun night for the Little Leaguers as well. They got a chance to run the bases before the game, hang out with some of the big guys. How about Catfish pitcher Brevin Yarbrough out of Chaffee getting himself a K right there. He was tough. The pitching was tough. Both sides. Caleb Herbert, though. Hey, how about that guy? Given the Thrillbillies that one nothing lead, they were really good in this game tonight, the Thrillbillies. They've been good all season as well. Catfish have just been out of this world. Yarborough, though, the strikeout to end that inning, and you can see him pop out of the dugout. That's how they're feeling it right there. But they trail one nothing into the eighth, talking about the Catfish were down but not out. Jeff Clark, couple guys on, brings a couple guys in. Made it. From one nothing, then they took the lead two to one. The Catfish came back. Yeah, they're celebrating, all right. They would go on and win three to one. That's 11 wins in a row for the Cape Catfish. How about that game winning hit, Jeff Clark? It was a great job all around. Our pitchers did an amazing job and they got it done. And then it just opened it up for one big hit in the end. And I'm glad I got it done. So. That smile says it all. The Catfish will try to make it 12 straight tomorrow at Kappahaw Field. 635 against the Jackson Rockabillies. They just keep on rolling. Nothing's slowing them down. It's like, hey, we're going to find a way to win. And they do, the close ones and the big ones.